Halo Infinite's multiplayer releasing on November 15th, this Monday? Rumors and leaks seem to suggest just that. But do you want to know why? Well, stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details. How's it going Halo fans? Kevin here once again giving you some more news and information about Halo. And there's been a, a storm of brewing if you will when it comes to potentially some big stuff happening on November 15th during Xbox's 20th anniversary celebration. So I want to break down all the little bits of news that have been kind of going around the internet for the last few days or so. And to answer the question, will we get multiplayer released on November 15th? Well let's figure it out. So if you guys like these news and informational kind of videos and want to see some more content like this, make sure to tap that like button. Let me know you like this kind of videos. And also, if you want to stay up to date with everything going on with Halo, make sure you subscribe to the channel as we're less than a month away from Halo Infinite's release. So let's get right into the content here. So we all know Joseph Staten said this. Uh -huh. I would like to announce that Halo Infinite's campaign and multiplayer will launch together on December 8th this year. So when you see that, you're probably like, story over. Game over right there, December 8th, we're releasing on that day, right? Well, maybe, maybe not. There have been hints and rumors of something big happening on November 15th for the 20th anniversary of Xbox and also Halo as well. The first bit of drop of this happened a few weeks ago with Jez Corden, who's a bit of a Microsoft insider for Windows Central News. And on IGN's podcast Unlocked, mentioned this about why Halo fans should be interested about November 15th. They brought up Halo specifically, so I have to, I have to wonder, is this where we're finally going to see Halo campaign gameplay. Uh, Jez, do you know anything? <laughs> you want to watch this show, I would say. Okay, okay. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Not <laughs> right way. I like that. Obviously, this information came out be just before the Halo Infinite campaign overview video, so we already got our gameplay right there, but Jez seems to know that something about Halo is happening on Monday, November 15th. And he's a rather credible source as well, so when Jez is excited about the day about Halo, I'm definitely gonna be excited about the day as well. We've seen various sources like right here, Halo.API, on Twitter, they do a lot of information when it comes to Halo stuff that they dig out and they say, Heroes of Reach, November 15th. Also stating, if I'm wrong, I'm giving away a $100 USD to a random follower. So that's quite a bit of confidence right there for sure. Halo.API also showcased this early access digital bundle that was on the Microsoft website, apparently kind of like in the hidden pages kind of thing, but then later it was also taken down. So could we get like an early access bundle of Halo Infinite? Maybe that would be pretty insane. Early access is pretty standard for a lot of games. Call of Duty did it, Battlefield did it as well, but we also did have like an early access with the flight, so we really kind of had this experience, but maybe this is kind of like play a few days early, but maybe play on November 15th. I mean, we just have to wait and see until the actual information comes out. Another guy who seems to have this ear to the ground when it comes to leaks and information, Serasia, basically responding to a tweet thread right here at the Mike Duquesne saying that he's glad that Halo Infinite isn't releasing this month, and he replies back, well, and Duquesne, much like myself, is rather skeptical about the date, but then he just says, you'll see. And of course, Halo tweeted out about this day as well, night, which you would expect because they're an Xbox game studio that they would tweet out the promotion for this day. But I checked out other Xbox game studios. They haven't tweeted about this 20th anniversary celebration. And another thing that really got my interest was a multiplayer designer of uh, Fernando. You've seen him in some of the Halo Infinite multiplayer discussion videos, stuff like that, saying, let's celebrate 20 years of Xbox together. You can't miss it in all caps right there, which Obviously, he could just be saying, hey, get excited about the day, but I just think that since he's a Halo dev, Halo's been really the only company that has been tweeting about this date. And on Xbox Wire blog, that they talk about this event, obviously, but when you scroll down a little bit, they specifically mention Halo, saying, we invite you to join us on November 15th for a 20th anniversary celebration of Xbox and Halo with a fun digital broadcast for fans across the globe. I mean, Halo wasn't the only game that launched with Xbox. I mean, it, it was synonymous and really helped launch the Xbox title as a whole for sure it was the reason why xbox succeeded in this first generation is because of halo but you know there were other games that were launched on the same time but they specifically mentioned halo here i just think there's too many little things that are just lining up in a certain way that makes me feel like if you're a halo fan you definitely want to keep note of november 15th now people have been saying also to me as well about saying that november 15th we could get the multiplayer early which would kind of make sense as the multiplayer was in a really good state 
during the flight. Yeah, there were some changes that needed to be made, some optimizations, but in the recent outcomes blog that we got that we covered on the channel here, they specifically mentioned that they changed a lot of things that they really felt like they needed to change. And so the multiplayer right now seems to be in a pretty good state. So could we see like an early access, like nearly a month early launch of the multiplayer? It certainly is possible since the multiplayer, like I said, seems to be in a pretty good state. And like how Chief said, the missions change, they always do. Oh, I love that line. That might be one of the new famous quotes from this game. Plus on Google, if you look on mobile guys, when you type in Halo Infinite, the first thing that comes up is saying like the release date and it's showing November 15th. There's a countdown timer for November 15th on Google. And it's been doing that for like the last two weeks. I thought it was just kind of like some weird bug or error or something like that. But Google's persistent with this. They're sticking with this date for whatever reason. So there is something a brewing for November 15th, guys. Just keep your eyes on for that date. I guarantee if anything does happen, I'll let you guys know on this channel as soon as possible. So if you want to know where to check it out, guys, again, it's Monday, November 15th. That is 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That means it's 1 p.m. Eastern and 6 p.m. GMT. You can find streams on YouTube, Twitch, and on Facebook as well. So I'll be keeping an ear to the ground for you guys. If any kind of news comes from this event, which I feel like there will be in some capacity, I'll let you know on the channel. But if you're new to this channel or missing any content from me recently, check out this playlist right here for all my recent Halo news and informational videos we've been uploading daily about. Thank you so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.